Hi, Cardinalis again with Green Tech Heat Solutions Tips. And today we're talking about a very important tip, the thermal insulator, AKA the moving blanket. Now, moving blankets are cheap. And if you've bought one of the Titan systems, you've probably had one or two of these included with the system, but I would encourage you to buy a whole lot more of these things. And let me tell you why. You know how Benjamin Franklin said a penny of preparation is worth a dollar of disaster or something like that? One moving blanket is worth a lot of trouble. <laughs> Um, let me exactly tell you why. First off, these you want to put on anything that might need protection from the actual ducting that comes out of the Titan system, especially with propane systems, this is ne necessary. With the ePro and the electrical systems, you don't worry about it, that extreme heat as much as you do with the Titan and the propane systems. Uh, unfortunately, all of us at some point, because we didn't have tips videos like these, have melted a vinyl window. Yes, just a week ago, I unfortunately put a duct through a window and it was sitting right on the vinyl plastic. Within, I'd say, two or three hours of heat coming through that duct, there was a small groove in the track of the window and now I have to replace the window. $450 error that could have been saved by a $4.50 thermal blanket. Also, if you fold these up and you place them underneath the ducts, meaning here is the duct, as it travels inside of the apartment or inside of the house, it will keep it from resting on the really nice wood flooring as well. So oftentimes you don't need these to necessarily protect anything particular other than providing a pad that the ducting can sit on. Also, these things are often helpful, helpful if you buy the biggest one possible. Because with the Titan system, you wanna make sure that the air isn't flowing and just barreling out of that door, and uh, just that enough to maintain the right pressure is coming out. So it's a good idea if you put this on top of the door and you staple around the door with the stapler I recommended in a previous video to keep that air inside. Now. This works a little bit better, I found, than the three mil sheets of plastic or anything else that restricts airflow because it's heavy. So in one sentence, I'd say having an extra seven or eight of these, especially at their price, is totally worth it and will save you a lot of trouble in the long run. Buy these.